Hello and welcome to another tutorial from How to Webmaster. Today I'm going to review and test out Bluehost website builder to see if it's any good. Here I am inside of my Bluehost customer dashboard and under my sites there is a button here at site. Check that out and here on the right side is the Bluehost website builder. Here under choose a domain. If you select here you can select any one of your domains or add-on domain and here in the directory if you don't want to install or build your website on the root directory of your domain I will install this new site on a directory folder called builder now click on next and now you get to choose what is your site about I would do let's try food and then click on continue now name your site let's say this is my restaurant now click on continue and now I get to choose a cover image and I can either upload my own image by clicking here or choose one of these below let's just click on that one now continue and I can now add a logo so I just went and made this logo really quick and here it is right here let's go to continue and now I get to choose a font okay I'll just stick with that let's continue now I can do either a dark or light actually white looks better and my branded colors okay so it's probably here okay I'll take this right here the green let's continue and you can check out different navigational style like this is centered this is more uh, left aligned okay I'll just do the center and here's the menu continue and now I can fill out my address and email for if the visitors want to contact me or check out my restaurant let's finish and now it is creating the site alrighty so here is a look inside of my dashboard or control panel and the first time using this it will show you a quick tutorial and tips uh, pop up right here and you can check these out but I'll skip the tour and now I can actually customize this in more detail for example here I can just click here type whatever I want and I can also if I select here I can highlight that and link it to one of my pages like contact location or a different URL or an email address or phone number and I can also change if I don't want this image I can click here click on this select image and I can upload my own image or search for stock photos and then I can have here I can link to my menu items or any other news or discount coupons newsletter down here so there's a lot of options even a gallery page and this right here is currently the home page if I select here I can check out other pages that was created let's check out the gallery so here is the current default gallery I can upload my own uh, food creations my dishes that I offer at my restaurant so there's a lot of customization options that you can play around with it's pretty easy there's no coding required everything is point and click drag and drop you can add new sections let's do a new section real quick and now I can choose to say add any one of these things right here a call to action business hours countdown even a map for my customers to see so there it is this is my address and here's my map and I can position this and if I click here it'll move the section up so now my map is down here so it looks a little bit better and that's how you move sections around okay let's do a quick preview see how my new restaurant website look there it is the gallery uh, nicely done here's my home very nice very easy and I can even do a preview on mobile devices so here when you click here is on the mobile phone this is what the customer will see and if they click here or they tap there gallery and here's my Google Maps and I can customize anything on this page very easy and then you click here to publish and now it is live okay here it is and this top bar will not show up if you're an actual visitor since I'm logged in that's why this bar is showing but for visitors they will only see this bottom part right here just exactly like in the preview 
All right, I hope this helps. Thanks so much for viewing and please subscribe to How to Webmaster for more tips, tricks, and tutorials. Thanks so much.